What's up guys, my name is Stacy from Leftovers Adventures. Today I just want to give you a bit of a review about these gloves I uh, got from Kimimoto. Check it out guys. Um, they came pretty fast. It took about maybe uh, two weeks to get posted here. Yeah? I received it in this nice um, bubble wrap envelope. Check it out. It's nice and protected. It feels quite nice. I reckon if you put any item in here, it'll be well protected from the post. So I've obviously opened it already because I'm wearing the gloves now. But uh, here's some more gloves it came with. It comes in this nice soft plastic stuff. It feels pretty good. I've got some white gloves as well. Thank you, Kimimoto's. Woo! So my first impression when I, when I got these gloves out the bag, I put them on my hand. They were a tight squeeze to get past the knuckles, but once they were on my hand, hence the saying, they fit like a glove. One thing I do love about these gloves for fishing is um, I actually sometimes forget they're on my hand because they're so, they got like a nice thin material um, and they're not, they're not super thick and bulky. They're, they're actually nice and thin and surprisingly, they're heavy duty as well. They feel like they're heavy duty. Um, I've been wearing them for the last three weeks, like really like putting them through the test um, and I must say they have they have really done well. If you can see here in the photo, um, there's a, the, the new gloves and there's the gloves that have been wearing for the last three weeks. You see the comparison, there's not much wear and tear. I reckon they'll last quite a long time these gloves. And so what I really love about these gloves is when I cast with a fishing rod, it, it's got a nice grip on the, on the rod. Uh, because of these uh, silicone patches on the bottom, it feels like the rod is nice in your hand, it's not going to slip or anything. And the other thing I love about these gloves is uh, the fingertips are cut off. It's nice for tying knots because um, you can actually feel the, uh, the fishing gut and you can tie the knots accurately. And uh, what I've been doing is when I've been tightening the knots, I've been actually wrapping the, the fishing line around my pinky and just pulling the knot on the hook a bit tighter. Because the glove has cut fingertips, you can feel the sensitivity of the fishing line better. So when the fish are biting the, the bait, you can actually feel it nicely. You can actually feel the, the fish biting. Another good thing with the cut of tips is when I put bait on the hook, I won't get bait on my actual glove. I'll just get it on my fingers so I can just wash it off. So that means I won't have any stinky gloves in my fishing bag which is pretty awesome. Oh, big boat, big boat, hold on, hold the camera. So we've been actually boating as well with these gloves like I'm doing now. Uh, it feels quite nice when, you, when you're driving and holding the steering wheel. Um, it feels good because it feels like you've got a nice grip as well. The steering wheel won't slip out of your hand. If a big wave came over and knocked you over and your hands landed on a, a knife or um, a hook or something, it's most likely you won't cut your hand because of the synthetic leather on the bottom and the silicone patches, see? So it just gives that extra protection. What they can improve with the gloves is, uh, see, you see the notches over there on the top? These ones here? These are to pull the gloves off your hand. I reckon they can actually make them a bit shorter because uh, it seems sometimes they're a bit too long. You know what I mean? Can you, can you see them on the side? Check. Yeah, sometimes uh, they feel like they're, they're in the way, especially if I'm like, doing some fishing with the line. Um, but besides that, I actually love these gloves. These are my new favorite gloves, by the way, guys. Uh, my old fishing gloves, uh, I'm just gonna keep them for another day. Just to protect your hand from the UV rays from the sun. Um, it was always important to wear gloves outside, especially in the Australian sun, because um, the worst thing is getting a sunburn on your hand and having to fish the next day with sunburned hands. It's not a good feeling. So I've been using these gloves as well to do some outside photography. It actually feels pretty good because of the silicone patches on the bottom. Um, it feels like I've got a, grip, a good grip on the camera. I won't drop the camera or something or won't slip out of my hand. It's nice because of the, 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 the cut of finger part as well. I can actually feel the camera and do the settings as well. And I reckon it's a better feeling to uh, actually feel the camera settings with your skin than having like a, a piece of material over there. They're very easy to wash. All you do is chuck them in the washing machine and you don't have to worry about them getting damaged or anything. When you do purchase these gloves, make sure you get the right size. Uh, Kimimoto does have a graph on the Amazon site. It shows you how to measure your hand. These are extra large and these are large gloves. When I put the extra large gloves on, it just feels a bit too baggy. 
So it's really important guys that you get the right size gloves. These gloves are I think perfect for the Australian weather um, because it's not that cold yet except winter it does get a bit chilly but yeah for the price these gloves go for they're really well worth it. Thanks for watching guys I'll leave a link below to the Kimimoto website check them out they've got some real cool stuff on the website and if you'd like to purchase these gloves I'll leave a link there as well. Keep on boating keep on fishing peace. Here comes a big boat. Another big boat. I'm never gonna get this done. Woo!